The Commission on Elections has almost completed its preparations for the December slated Barangay and Sangguniang Kabataan elections, including the printing of ballots, which the poll bodies share assured will not go to waste even if the electoral exercise is actually postponed. Mela Les Moras has more. Although some are still pushing for its postponement, the Commission on Elections said they are now almost 80% ready for the 2022 Barangay and Sangguniang Kabataan elections. At the Laging Handa program, Comelec Chairman George Garcia stated that this month, they are also set to start the ballot printing for the elections. And even if the polls are deferred, he assured that the ballots will not be wasted. Wala pong effect yan sapagat yung balota na naprint natin ay pwede pa rin gamitin para sa susunod na eleksyon kung sakali na mariset ang December 5, 2022 elections. In a recent decision released by the Supreme Court, qualified persons deprived of liberty can now vote again at the local level which was welcomed by the COMELEC. Ang una pong parule dyan, Sir Audrey, ay number one, kung yung botante mismo, yung PDL versus the private liberties po, ay uh, botante doon sa lugar kung saan sila nakakulong sa kasalukuyan o in custody, doon po sila makakaboto. Kung sakali naman po, nasa ibang lugar, pwede po silang samahan mismo ng ating uh, mga custodian Subalit, kinakailang magpaalam po sa korte. To further improve the election system in the country, Comelec Chairman Garcia is now pushing for new initiatives like implementing early voting system for senior citizens and persons with disabilities as well as internet voting for Filipinos overseas. Melales Moras for The Nation.